Hey guys, Life is No Yolk. Today, we're making the easy and fresh filling, wonderfully addicting detox salad. It gets you that, well, what food scientists, junk food creators call the bliss point. More on that in a second. First, let's make it. For all the chopping we're gonna do, you can use a food processor, you can chop by hand. We're using the Vitamix because that's what we do around here. One of the benefits to having one of the low profile 64 ounce containers, you can do more, it's easier. It's great for making detox salad. So we're gonna take carrots, cauliflower, cabbage, and kale and chop them up into coarsely chopped small pieces. That's the essence of it. If you are using the Vitamix, fill the container with small-ish sized pieces. Nice. If it's bigger than the palm of your hand, it's probably too big, except for maybe the carrots. You can put the whole carrot sticks in there. Those work really well. And they all work really nicely because these are hard vegetables. So it's really easy to chop them up and they kind of bounce around the container. So we'll use variable speed one. We're using the pulse button. This kind of helps us just prevent over processing. But if you don't have a pulse button, just variable speed one for a few seconds. The key is to not do too much at a time. About a third of the container full is about the right amount. Any more than that, you kind of get unevenly processed, too finely chopped pieces at the bottom. So we are gonna use the tamper. It kind of helps kind of move things around. The pieces bounce off of it. It just, the tamper really helps here. So again, we're doing the carrots, we're doing the cauliflower, we're doing the cabbage and the kale. We're making this look easy and it is easy. I can't tell you how many times Shalva said, oh God, I just made detox salad. I just love how easy it is to make and then how easy it is to clean up. You don't have to clean the container in between each blend because it's all getting mixed together anyway. Once everything's coarsely chopped, mix it all together. Now, if you have a rabbit, put some of this in their bowl. If you have a child or a, a friend you want to impress, try one of these dressings. In the original detox salad recipe tutorial and on our website, we have this wonderful citrus avocado dressing. Here's how you make that. That's a quarter cup of apple cider vinegar, one avocado, half a lemon, peeled, half a lime, peeled, two tablespoons of fresh ginger, that looks about right, a date for sweetness and salt and pepper to taste. You mix that all together and you have this perfect dressing for this detox salad. Lately, we've been doing kind of a shortcut version, which is maybe just as good. Sunflower seeds, raisins, an equal parts balsamic vinegar and extra virgin olive oil. If you're whole food plant-based, just throw some avocado in instead of the oil. No matter what dressing you use, the sunflower seeds and the raisins are great with this. Mix it all together, serve it. Believe it or not, children really like this. It's crunchy, it's filling, it's flavorful. And like I said in the beginning, it hits that bliss point. Bliss point is what food scientists that work for junk food companies aim for. That curious balance of many different flavors like Dr. Pepper and Doritos. It's something that fires your brain in a lot of different places and keeps you coming back. You never get sick of all of the flavors together. And that's the beauty of this. This detox salad is addicting, like the junk food that's made in laboratories, but it's so good for you. Fills you up, doesn't make you feel full, gives you energy, you know the whole thing. This detox salad, baby, it's so good. Get in the habit of making this on Mondays after a long weekend of uh, indulging. It just kind of makes you feel good. And guys, uh, subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Hit that bell to get notified. And if you appreciate videos like this, hit that thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Hi guys, I wanna give you a few tips and tricks about this detox salad. Since we've been making it every week for like three years, we've learned a few things that work really well. The first is to serve it in a glass bowl. When you put it in an opaque container, you forget that it's in the fridge. If it's in glass, it looks delicious. The second thing is that you don't wanna pre-dress this salad. Have the dressing and the salad separate because it gets kind of icky if you dress it and leave it for too long. Another thing that we've noticed after doing this for a really long time is that we used to make a huge batch of this, a full cauliflower, a full thing of cabbage, and by day five, six, seven, it's just really unappetizing now. So make a smaller batch, you'll end up eating more of it if you make a smaller batch. Uh, another thing I like to do is keep the toppings for the salad out on my counter. So we put raisins and sunflower seeds in the salad, but they don't taste as good if they've been sitting in the salad for two, three days. This salad lasts really, really well for a few days, but it tastes better if you can put those crunchy little 
bits in later. So I leave the raisin sunflower seeds out on my counter. The most helpful thing I think for this salad, which we lovingly call it our house mama salad, um, is that sometimes I don't have time or the ingredients to make the avocado dressing. The avocado dressing is so good, but it's extra. Most of the time, I'd say nine, can you hear my kid talking? Nine out of 10 times that we make the salad, I don't make the dressing, I just make the ingredients for the core salad, and then I dress it with a little bit of olive oil and a little bit of balsamic vinegar. One of the things that I love about this particular recipe is that, first of all, I just stock the ingredients every week, so these things are always in our fridge, but if someone comes to our house, they know that we love to cook, they're not expecting to be fed, but it's a nice treat if they are. And this is one of those things that I just end up throwing together. I had a friend come in from New York and she sat at our counter and I said, coffee, detox salad? Um, and that just seemed kind of natural. And she was so excited to have something healthy and filling right after she got off the airplane. So I've ended up doing that several times. My mom will come over to watch the kids and I'll say, just made a fresh batch of detox salad. Feel free to go at it. The other thing is that this salad is really good on its own as a meal, especially if you can add some protein. A lot of times Lenny will just dump some chickpeas on top. That then adds some protein. It makes it a complete meal. Um, but also a lot of times I serve it on the side. So I'll have some soup and the detox salad. I'll have a sandwich with the detox salad on the side. Our sisters make this weekly now too. It's just one of those things that's so good to have in the fridge all the time. Once we all go back to work someday, it's an excellent thing to pack with you. Um, you don't have to heat it or cool it. It can be room temperature um, and it keeps really, really well in the fridge. So enjoy our mama salad. Nope, you're doing the tamper. Nope, you're doing the tamper. So good. Boom, done. Done? Yep. It's perfect. I want to show it to Dada. Okay, show it. Perfect, thank you. Okay, Mama, turn. One. I made this one. Two. I made this one too. Three. I made this one. That one looks like a nose. Four. Five. <laughs> no, this. Are you doing the tamper or the button? The tamper! All right, ready? Thank you. Good waiting. Alright, do it. Okay. You ready? Tamper? It can go in in a big chunk like that. Just put that whole thing in. Perfect. That whole big thing can go in. Dump it. The whole thing. Yeah. In. Yeah. In. In. What's this? It's, it's nothing. It's nothing. It's nothing. Top one. Okay. Wait. Okay. 
Okay, tamper. Ready? Go. Perfect. Wait, a little more. Tamper in. How's Judas? He's not thrilled. <laughs> nice. Kind of mulling. Okay, in. Yeah, that one is icky. It just had some brown spots on it, so I didn't want to eat it. All right, last ones. In. In. Nice. Oh, oh, I'm... You doing tamper or button? Tamper? Last ingredient. Don't oh, scrape it. Me scrape it. Me. I'd like to scrape it, please. Mm. All right. Good job. Okay. Climb on up. Can you what? Helpers listen. You're right. Helpers listen. Ready to help? Huh? What are we making? Salad. salad. Mama salad. What else? Dressing. Dressing. All right. So you guys go make some detox salad, some mama salad, and some dressing. Ready for our opinions. Are you Olaf? Olaf. <laughs> <laughs> Olaf. Dada Olaf. Let's rinse that one. This is on my face.